Hi everybody and welcome to this gameplay demo of Overpass. I am Joachim Eriksson, head of production at Sodex Racing and I'm very excited to show you the game today. Overpass is a tough challenge where you have to power through extreme off-road tracks with buggies and quads. The goal is to do it as fast as possible, but at the same time you have to be smart and precise in your maneuvering to find the most efficient way of getting across the track. We're going to try out the hill climb track today. The goal is to reach the top of the hill as fast as possible. It's quite short in terms of distance, but steep and each centimeter can turn into a nightmare of mud and rocks and you'll have to find your way to get through. The tracks are designed to be challenging with many different obstacles to discover, both natural and artificial. Every track has a multitude of solutions and often several paths to reach the goal. Drive too fast and you'll most likely overload the suspension which will make you bump hard into the terrain and lose speed instead of gaining it. I don't seem to be able to move past this section here. I'll engage the differential lock to maximize the traction. This synchronizes all wheels to push the vehicle forward together, which helps a lot in situations like this. The drawback is, it's really hard to turn as the wheels want to push the vehicle in the forward direction. Engage it wisely for the right situations is my advice, and don't forget to disengage it once you've passed the tough passage and want to restore the steering ability. In Overpass you'll find many vehicles, both buggies and quads from Arctic Cat, Polaris, Suzuki and Yamaha. You have to select the one that seems best for the race for you before you get going. Overpass is a bit of a physics playground as well, where each vehicle and terrain got its particularity. Trying to get to the top, you'll need to find the best grip with the right amount of power to go up as efficiently as you can. Even with the differential lock engaged, it's sometimes hard to get the vehicle moving upwards if the passage is steep enough. In some situations, it's wiser to back up a little in order to get enough momentum to overcome the steep passage. I'm very careful with the throttle here to avoid slipping in this steep passage. Too much throttle will make the vehicle lose grip and slide back down. Usually the first time you try a track, you'll think more about the exploration to understand what we got there for you. And only then you'll be able to optimize your time and try to progress the leaderboards. I can't stress enough to be careful and precise with the throttle to avoid getting the wheels losing grip and getting into spin. Thank you for watching this video and hope that you will try our game. See you next time.